Welcome back everyone, here's ZH2 Motorsports. We are back yet again with another diecast review. Today it's going to be, I'll give you, it's quite an interesting car to talk about because not only was this one of the brand new teams for 2022, I mentioned in the previous video I got some metal chassis cars, I'm still pissed off about it. Well, either way, we are taking a look at a um, interesting car, as mentioned before, from a new team. That it, not only that, it was driven by a fellow New Englander. Today, we take a look at Kaz Grala's 2022 Pit Viper number 54. Um, the money team, I think it was. Uh, the, the team that Floyd Mayweather owns. Yeah, now, yeah, the sport is such in decline. Floyd Mayweather is now fielding a part-time team for crying out loud. Yep, it's, drove, it's driven by Kaz Grella. It's metal chassis car. Why don't we get this car out of package, take a closer look, and just talk about it. Okay, we are back. And this... This is a um, car I can talk about. Well, it, it, the damn thing is so strange. I don't know what to tell you. So basically, we have a boatload of color on the car, but it's it's a weird one because you have all this color on the side, and it's only pretty much only on the fucking hood. Pit Viper. I think they're sunglasses, or maybe there's something other stupid. Who knows? That's why I, th I think these idiots make sunglasses, but I could be wrong about that. Um, it is an interesting car, to say the least. Uh, Kaz Grala. Grala. Why the fuck is that Chevy logo? Why the fuck is that Chevy logo not painted? What the hell? Pay 15 bucks for this crap, and this how you ever pay us? The number 50... Um, Grawla, Pit Viper, uh, Pit Viper, but a lot of other sponsors, NFT, hooray, that crap is on the car, you have an M, hooray, PitViper.com, the 50, um, a bit strange to have the yellow Goodyear on the blue background, but okay, Cup logo, and yes, it is the uh, metal chassis. You can tell because it's nice and shiny. And yeah, Lionel Racing. Please kill us. We don't have to put up with you idiots. Uh, yeah, it has the same fucking problem. No rubber tires. It's just plastic crap. Um, it, it, it's somewhat as interesting. Uh, as you can see right here with the wrap, the decal wrap goes to the window here. And seriously, it doesn't even fit the cockpit car. What the fuck? This is fifteen dollars. Uh, American ethanol ring. I mean, the, the paint scheme itself is interesting. I'll give you that. It's it's you didn't put a plain car on the field. I will give you that. But the car just really is on a whole lot. Demands respect and authority. I don't know. I mean, I think this, I'm not going to lie to you, it kind of looks like a, kind of looks like a unicorn just kind of puked all over a Gen 7 car. I'm not going to lie to you. Looks like a bunch of unicorn vomit. I mean, it's not bad, but it's just, <laughs> it's a weird car. I mean, you do have these nice spikes on the hood. I do like that. Um... I mean, the fade is okay. I mean, you got the blue to the pinkish here, or, the, or magenta, I don't really know what you'd say it. Through the red, to, to the orange, to the yellow, and then it just stops. Why the fuck does it just stop here? Shouldn't it go all the way to the back? I, I think that's kind of more of the paint scheme than Lionel, but... Seriously. For 15 goddamn bucks, you're not really getting a whole lot. I don't know if this come out in the gold series. I would imagine this would come out in the gold series as like a regular car. 
Um, overall, I would not pay 15 bucks for this crap. I'm sorry, but I know I keep saying that this is 15 bucks, but 50 bucks for no rubber tires. Yes, I know it's a minuscule thing, but what the fuck? What the fuck? Overall, it's a halfway decent car. Pick it up if you want. Um, I'll give you, it's interesting. Not for the right reasons, but it's interesting, to say the least. What do you think about this car? What do you think? Well, are you going to pick it up? Let's hope not. This has been ZH2 Motorsports. Like, comment, subscribe. Tell me, are you going to buy this car? Like I say, don't.